Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clayton. In today's video, we're going to be checking out my new Tempest Razorback class setup in Modern Warfare 2. Let's try to get 40 likes on today's video. That would help out a bunch and it'll help push out the video to other people looking for the same kind of content. Jumping straight into the attachments. All right, so jumping straight into the attachments, on this class setup you already get an optic as you can see whenever i go into the firing range there's already one there so i highly recommend using this blueprint if you don't have it it is fine i don't think the optic is on the regular gun but i'm not too sure on that so don't really take my word for it but on this class setup i'm using the schlager peq box for aim down sight speed there is no cons which makes this laser probably the best one over on the laser tuning, I'm going with negative 0.32 ounces for sprint to fire speed, and I put uh, the zeroing distance all the way over for aim down sight speed. Over on the barrel, this might... I'm not... Okay, Oh, it's, so this barrel is what gives you the optic. Okay, I was wrong. So for the barrel, I'm using the 13-inch Frenzy IX barrel. I, I don't know what number that is, but for the pros, it is aim down sight speed and hip recoil control. The cons are damage range, hip fire accuracy, and a bullet velocity. The barrel tuning I went with is 0.39 pounds for recoil steadiness and 0.27 inches for damage range. Over on the muzzle, I'm using the Echo Lion GSX for sound suppression and recoil smoothness. The cons are damage range. The muzzle tuning I went with is 0.90 ounces for recoil smoothness and 0.65 inches for bullet velocity. Over on the underbarrel, I'm using the phase three grip, adds aiming auto stability, hit fire accuracy, recoil stabilization. The cons are walking speed and aim down sight speed. For the underbarrel tuning, I went with negative 0.65 ounces for aim down sight speed and negative 0.22 inches for aim walking speed. And I am using the ammunition over pressured, it adds target flinch. The ammunition tuning, I went with damage range all the way up because I really don't care too much about like trying to make everything perfect and i went ahead and put it all the way over for bullet velocity that's going to do it for this class setup i will probably end up making a better one in the future but if you guys end up trying this class setup out and you like it please let me know down in the comments or if there's a better class setup out there that you like please let me know what that is down in the comments i have a crazy gameplay for you guys i think i ended up dropping at mgb so if you enjoyed that make sure to hit the like button and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace I think I need to fix my frames. That didn't work at all. God, what is wrong in this game? everything's good uh, it's usually like i didn't even see him this usually only happens like on my very first game i haven't played on controller in so long i've been playing nothing but valorant I was really waiting on that guy to peek me, but he wouldn't. Might just be me, but I hate this map. I don't understand. There's just so many spots to look at, like people camping. Secure the area. 
I need to get something going though. I thought there was another guy here. That guy's one. Oh my God, how many bullets does it take? Need more ammo. came back a nuke would be insane I've been camping this entire game. No way! He killed. Alright, whatever. Time to win the game. Got 40 kills.
can't believe I got headshotted off my nuke, bro. This gun is good, it's just in situations like that, I should kill all of them. I was spawn trapping them for a second. Oh my god, 66 kills. I wish I would have dropped the nuke, but it's whatever.